Hello? Here we go. Hello, everybody. We'll be slow to start here as I um, let people start to arrive and I'm gonna work on audio levels as usual. Make sure everything sounds okay. Uh, let's see here. Put my chat over here. Nani. Oh, oh, okay. Here we go. Whoa, whoa. Okay. Hey, guys. Why am I... <laughs> am I standing? Huh? <laughs> hey, everybody. The, uh... Hey, Scott. I hope you enjoyed Japan. You had a great trip. Um, I'm not feeling great. Uh, um, if I go off like that, it means I'm coughing. Uh, Becky and I had a really bad flu, and then we got over it, and now I have a cold. And. That sucks. It's just never ends. Uh, all right, I might have to like the built-in chat in OBS is really big, way too big for me. Why glasses? Because I can't see. I mean, I can. It's like, my eyes are starting to get a little, a little foggy. How's the audio, everybody? Yeah, the old man glasses are just a thing that has to happen when you get old. <laughs> I've always had like, perfect vision. It was the one thing I had perfect. I got pussy wrists and I don't hear so good out of one ear because of punk concerts um but uh my eyes are always amazing and then you know you hit 40 and everything falls apart so I just like you know I have to like hold things a bit further away like I don't even think these glasses are good though because like They're good for a very specific distance. They're good for looking at the keyboard when I need to type, but the distance of the screen to my face, I think, doesn't really work. So they're actually, like, I'm just using them, using them for novelty. Just like the mustache, it's just a novelty today. <laughs> like, I probably aren't, I'm not gonna use them, I don't think, because the screen, I think they're built for having a phone, which is, like, much closer to your face than this. Thanks, everybody. Cass, you started to use them. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks. I'm glad everybody appreciates the stash. I'm glad to be back. I've been, uh, it's been half a year, right? My baby is six months old, and she is now in nursery school. Uh, for like four hours a day, which really, it's messing with me. Like, I'm getting better at it. The first few days were really terrible. 
Oh, the text is so big on this chat, I can't keep up. It, everything goes by. Um, she's doing good, though. I think she, it's, it's really good for her. She actually, I feel like she's in a great mood when she comes home. Like, they, these people are professionals. They do all sorts of fun stu stuff with her. I'm gonna mute myself for myself here. I think I'm, well, I'll keep it up for a bit more. It's hard to talk when you're listening to yourself, but it also gives me a lot of confidence in my mix and how it sounds compared to the game audio. I like doing that before we start. Um, thank you for that, AJYT. I think Echo is the coolest name. And I don't know how many of you heard, but her middle name is Fury, which is extra badass. If she ever want, if she ever wanted to start a band, I think she'd have a pretty cool frontman name. Uh, <coughs> shit. Excuse me. So I turned on voice isolation mode today. It sounds a little tinnier when you have voice isolation on, but it'll allow my uh, coughs not to be as bad here. This is standard. Hello? Hello? Like, you can hear the bass comes back, I think. I don't know what you guys prefer, but if I were to cough off camera without voice isolation, it's like... <coughs> so... I'll, I'll put it back on like that. It, it's... To me, it sounds pretty good in both. Like, it's just different. The bad thing about voice isolation mode is it gets rid of, like, breaths, so if if I'm annoyed at something and I go, like, it cuts off my breath, so you don't, you don't get the full effect of, like, exasperation. It, it, like, cuts it off midway. But anyways, for today, I'm gonna leave it on because it allows me to cough without you guys having to hear it so bad. <laughs> It's worse when I... Alright, I'm taking these off. I'll put them on right before I start. It's a it's fun novelty, and I do kind of need them, but for s this particular setup, unless a game has a lot of really fine text, I probably won't need them. Um, but I'm going to go to an, a proper optometrist, because they said I need bifocals, because... Everything in a distance is just slightly blurry. Everything up close is just slightly blurry. I need like this perfect in between. Though I don't find myself caring about the distance that much. There's not a lot of fine text in the distance. All right, I'm sorry if I miss anything here, guys. There's a, a lot of... <laughs> yeah, Salmon. I love my stash. I had a full beard going through the winter, and one night I just got so sick of it. It was itching, and I was like, fuck this beard. So I went into the kitchen, got the razor and buzzers, and just took it off. And in the morning, I, um, we woke up, and Becky's like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, my beard was gone, and I just had a stash. So this man woke up next to her like, how you doing? I've been taking care of our baby. <sighs> oh, you missed the little Inferno Christmas stream this year. Oh. I'd like to do Christmas games again. Uh, I'm still figuring out what streaming will look like going into the future with this show. I love streaming. I'm glad to come back to it. I've been craving it. And now that the uh, baby is in um, nursery school, I'm going to be able to do a lot more of it. Uh, but uh, <laughs> that's awesome. Gremlin. I'm glad I gave you the inspiration for Mutton Chops. I mean, it's 
it's basic bitch, right, Chris Bliss, the setup, but it it's bread and butter too, like it works, you know. The only thing to me with a this basic bitch setup, I don't mind that people do it, like it's just bare bones and you let your the content carry you, you know. Um, what I don't like is when streamers are playing and they play the game like this. Like, come on. It's not hard to flip your fucking view so that it looks at least like I'm looking at the game. That's the that's the main thing I have an issue with these types of setups. You see people who are like, they're like, all right, we're gonna play the game, guys. It's like, what are you looking at? The game is there on your setup. Fucking set it up so it looks like you're looking at it. You know, you don't have to have our crazy setup to make it look like you're looking at the screen. You just need to like, pay attention and flip your fucking angles. Um. But anyways, like, this is, this is possibly temporary, um, I think all the time about setting up a, a couch or chairs again and making it so that we can do our old stream, but, you know, we're, we're gonna take it a little bit at a time, you know? Because, uh, Beck with her job is not fully available, and this is way more comfortable for me to sit at my ergonomic, uh, Herman Miller chair instead of a couch slouching as I get older. Well, welcome, Cam Likes Jam. I'm 12, and what is this? <coughs> Thanks, Derek. I loved the old setup, too, but, you know. You think my voice got deeper? That's just because of the nature of this um, microphone. Um, I'm going to make this chat window a bit bigger. There we go. Maybe I can keep up a bit better now. Let me see if the gameplay... Well, the gameplay will just go... Oh, if I click away from... I can't see the chat if I... How do I make this always on top? God damn it. If I click away from uh, uh, OBS and I have to to play the game, I lose the chat. I thought it would just stay on top. Alright, well, maybe it's fine if I dock it then. It kind of defeats the purpose of undocking if it you lose it when you go away. Ugh. Then it's kind of useless when I I might I might just have to not use OBS chat. Sorry, I'm not reading the chat right now, guys. I'm trying to um, screw that. Then I'll just go to YouTube and pop theirs out. I'll pop out the normal chat. Yeah, now I can zoom out anyways, because the that text was too big. Sorry for the slow start, guys. I'm getting back into this, deciding what feels right. I think I'm gonna have to make this uh window a bit smaller. Game window's gonna get a bit fun funky. How'd that look? Did it change when I moved it? Yeah, it did. Alright, I have to like redo this. How's that for size? Do you guys like me this big, or do you want me smaller? Like, should I be down like that, so I don't cut off anything? I'm gaming on the Mac today while streaming on the Mac. Um, uh, I wish I could always do this, but not all games allow it to happen, because some don't run on the Mac, and then some run on the Mac, but if you click away from the game, you lose all audio from the game. I wish I could play everything and stream everything on the Mac, because I prefer streaming on the Mac. Um, it's just a smoother experience for me, and I find the M... I have an M2 Pro, and I find it better than my RTX 4070 for streaming, amazingly, like, I, it actually is better. 
People don't understand how good the new M chips are from Apple. Uh, anyway. But, what was I gonna say? Yeah, some games don't me, let me click away properly. The other benefit is I get to play in 4K, because my capture card is just 1080p, and I get to actually see the game in 4K if I capture the screen. Anyway. Did you guys know that, like, the M chips, like, you know, $700, $700 Mac Mini can play Cyberpunk on Ultra settings with Apple's new, like, wrapper. They, they, like, created some sort of technology that, like, automatically lets games run. It's not for the consumer, it's for the developer's sake, but people, of course, like, hacked it so that they can use it, not just the developer, and so people are having games run. The zoom blur stops, stops if I click away from the, the OBS, okay. So the game zoom blur is gonna go away sometimes too. <laughs> this, is, this is such little weird things. So if I click away from OBS, zoom blur goes away, I think. Is what it looks like. All right, that's just gonna be how it is, I guess. It's, that's a really weird thing to happen, huh? Um. <coughs> Will it be completely distracting if the background isn't blurred? Like. It might be, because you have extra text below. Maybe I should just do a black background today. Or maybe, like... I don't know. Yeah, it's kind of distracting. Black background looks really lame. <clears throat> Let me just see if I can add a different filter, not zoom blur, and maybe it will work. Let's see. What else do I have to choose from? Hmm... Let's see. Here's where I get real intimate. Gosh, and that doesn't look right. Doesn't look like it's working at all. Let's see. Gosh, there. Nope. Pixelation? That could be kind of fun. Hmm. For this type of game. Alright. I mean, that's kind of cool. Is that too distracting? Doodle scale percentage. What do you mean, doodle scale? Snap percentage. I don't know what these mean. Doodle? What the? Oh, it like makes a stop motion... Oh, interesting. It like gives it a weird jitter effect. Oh, that's distracting. Weird. What the fuck? It's so weird. Alright, I'm turning that off. Sorry, I didn't get your guys' opinion on the pixelization. That kind of, that's kind of cool. I kind of like that. Like, it's got a copy of the menu down below, but, like, it's not completely distracting, because obviously that's not, like, a part of the game. It looks like it's... Does it still work when I click away? Uh, let's see. Yeah, it still works. I might just... Ex you know, and I think that's what I'm gonna do with these streams, too, is, like, experiment a little bit. Just kinda... feel it out, because back in the day, with the old setup, I was so, like... anal about making sure it was all tested and perfect as it could be, and then... you go to stream, and it's not perfect, because something always fucks up, and it gets really upsetting. That's, I would get in a bad mood, and everything, but, like... If I don't, you know, maybe just play it loose and easy. Like, sometimes you just figure some shit out on stream. I'm just figuring shit out. And we get to hang out while I do. 
Here, I'm gonna make it a bit bigger. Huh. I'll get your opinions as the stream goes on whether you find that pixelization too distracting or not. All right. I'll get started soon. <laughs> uh, all right. Second, I have to. I'm gonna turn off the mic because I have to snort. <laughs> I'm stuffed up here. This is All right, I'm back. God, it's been a long month of sickness. It's been terrible. All right, guys. Okay. <laughs> Fuck me. Ah, <coughs> uh, God. Jesus! God damn! God. How's the audio anyways? My balance with the game. I'm pretty sure we already covered this. Like, it's not bad. I want to put the camera so it looks like when I look at myself or at the chat, it kind of looks like I'm looking at the camera. So, like... Unlike the old setup, I'm not burning the chat into the stream, but on the other hand, I'm not, you know, the YouTube chat is right here, so, like, it'll always stay here. People, you know, so if I'm like, does this look like I'm kind of looking at you guys? Like, looking at the camera? Because I'm, it's right next to it. The camera. This is me looking at the camera, and then this is me looking at the chat. It doesn't quite look like I'm looking into your eyes, does it? Does it? Huh. Like, it's a little bit different, right? This is me looking right at the camera, and this is me reading the chat. I think it looks a bit different, but anyway. I can also, because I'm using the iPhone, the iPhone, that's why I like to stream on the Mac, because I don't have to have two capture cards, one for my GH5 and one for the gameplay. I can <coughs> friggin' uh, use the iPhone as a webcam, and it's such good quality. Okay. So, all right, guys. Let's start the show. All right. Hey, buddies. Welcome to the show. I'm checking out. I'm sick, first of all. And I'm back after six months of dadding. Uh, and uh, I'm just going to try to get back into the swing of things. Uh, I'm a dad now. So I got a mustache and uh, reading glasses. I actually use these, but I probably won't need them today for a game with this big uh, stuff. But... I hope you can feel the dadness coming through. <laughs> I got a cold, so you're going to hear me every so often. I'm going to have to go up to the side. I heard a lot about this game on the Twitter feed. People have been tweeting about it, and I hear it's good, and it's a card game. I don't know anything other about it besides that it's uh, kind of poker-inspired. Um, I'm just going to mute my one second here make it so I don't hear myself anymore uh, here we go M um, monitor off there we go can you guys still hear me I think that should work um, testing all right all right Let's jump in. I'm excited to try this out. I'm gonna play with controller because that's how I prefer to You can hear you can hear good stuff. All right, let's begin. Here I go uh, 
the controller turned off. Okay. All right. Video game. Video games. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Video games. Let's see what we got here. Uh. Uh. Oh, I'm just gonna, I'll, I'll adjust settings as I go. Here we go. Ah, oh, the Joker's going to be my guide. Hello there, my name is Jimbo. I'm here to help uh, help you learn how to play. He sounds like uh, one of those fucking animals from the forest. Uh, your goal is to learn earn chips to defeat the enemy blind. Here's a small blind. You need to score 300 chips to beat it. Okay. Select the small blind to start the round. Okay. Select. Okay. How when, when did this game come out? Has it been around for a while? I just know that everybody loves it. I hear it like it just gets a lot of uh, talkiness on the Twitter for the indie game people. You play. You earn chips by playing poker hands. Each poker hand earns a base amount of chips multiplied by some. M-U-L-T's. Okay. See your poker hands in the run info area. Along with other info about your current run. A few months it's been out. Alright. Poker hands. Blinds. Vouchers. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna assume that I'll be able to learn this better as I go. Cards also earn you some chips hover over them to see i get 10 chips nine chips seven five chips just drawing these cards gives me chips okay okay sounds good next now select up to five cards to play and press play hand oh so you get to like build a hand out of a selection of cards of eight cards so it's a bit different from poker. I don't, I mean, I don't play a lot of poker, but I feel like this is a bit different. Well, I'm probably gonna go Jack, Queen, King. Uh, I mean, am I looking for, I'm assuming that they're gonna let me draw more cards and keep, like, let me see the run in, oh shit, I chose three cards instead of five. Can I? I have no idea what I'm doing. You can also discard up to five selected cards to try and make it even more stronger hand. Okay, you're looking for... Did I just discard cards and not play them? <laughs> what? Uh, you may, you want to make poker hands from your eight cards by keeping them. So like by selecting them, I'm getting rid of them or like... Oh, press X to play the hand. Okay, so get rid of my weak stuff, I guess, is what's happening here. You played the king high. Oh, man. All right, I'm gonna just, like, keep... All right, I'm taking off these glasses because I'm not using them. They're just getting in the way. Oh, look how young and beautiful I look now. Mmm. 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 All right. Hey, Mike. All right. I think I'm discarding, so I'm gonna like... <coughs> select the cards first. Get rid of these, get rid of these. I'll just do those four. I don't think I want them. I mean, I've got three on suits, whatever. I'm just getting rid of those. I don't know what I'm doing. I lost... Okay, careful. You only have a limited number of hands to discard and discards per round. Oh, so I'm going to play a total of ha number of hands. Okay, I'm starting to understand a bit now. Don't worry. Uh, you're trying to make the best hand possible, but the hand is what I play. So, okay. So discarding lets me draw more cards. Playing my hand lets me draw more cards and plays the hand. Uh, okay. Earn 300 chips before you run out of hands to win this round. Okay, so it's like a puzzle in a way. All right. Um, all right. 
so I don't know poker well and I kind of dislike it. <laughs> if I go to run info, they're showing me like what cards I can get, a full house, like at least I know what these are, kinda. Straight flush, all on suit and in sequence, uh, four of a kind, <coughs> full house. <coughs> mm -hmm. Five cards that share the same suit, a straight, three of a kind, two pair. Okay, they're keeping it pretty simple. I feel like, are there more hands than this? Yeah, dude, I don't even, I didn't even know whether, Cody, I didn't even know whether I was making my hand or discarding or what the fuck. I don't fucking... <laughs> I have a full house? What? Oh, like, you're saying I have, th yeah, I do have a full house, don't I? Alright, so yeah, let's do my full house. So I'll play that. There are secret hands, interesting. But in, even in, in poker in general, isn't there more hands than this? Or is this all the hands there are in poker that they've listed right here? I feel like there's more like different hands than this. That's it? Wow, I always thought poker had like way more. All right. Oh yeah, there's like, yeah, like a royal flush. Then I get a multiplier. Oh, I already won. Okay. Hmm. <coughs> easy game. Too easy, I'll refund it. <laughs> Nicely done, now that you're flush with cash, you can buy some new cards from the shop. Okay. Try buying this handsome devil. Alright. This is one of the 150 jokers you can add to your run. Every joker does something different. Alright, so here's where the spice comes, eh? Alright. This one adds plus four multiplier to every hand you play. Fun. Be picky. You can only carry five joker cards at a time. Now buy the other card from the shop. Empress. All right, so we're mixing tarot in with poker. All right, enhances two selected cards to multi cards. All right. I hope there's not too much fucking math in this though. <laughs> the tarot. This tarot card is a consumable. This one will enhance your playing cards. Hold on to it. All right. You can carry up to two consumable cards with you at any time. All right. If you save up enough, you can buy a voucher. Vouchers passively upgrade your run. Okay. Alright. Forever? Oh, like a run. A run, obviously. Um, vouchers are restocked after you defeat a boss blind. And check out the other booster packs in every shop. They're full of goodies. Oh, but can I buy it? Oh, they're not letting me buy that one. Let's move on to the next round. All right. Uh, there's not a whole lot of math. Most of the time you can just wing it. Good, because that's, you know, you guys know me. <laughs> I'm more of a feel guy. I like to go with the feel as opposed to the math. Like, that's why I like when I play Magic. That's why I like a brand new set. And I like to play um, a limited format, like sealed uh, you know draft because like there's so many what ifs that you can't even really rely too much on your math like obviously there's obvious math to rely on but i like it when there's so many potential outcomes that trying to rely on math too much is kind of silly like i prefer games that are just like just fucking go with your heart you know uh, I like the math being involved. I just don't want it to be like, if you don't do better math, you suck at this game type of thing. Um, all right. I'm sure people can play it like that, but I'd rather not. Selecting the big blind will earn some cash. All right. 
Or choose to skip it and get a tag. Each tag has a unique effect. Okay. But keep an eye on the boss blind. It has the ability... It has an ability you'll need to plan around. Discards. Two random cards per hand played. Uh-oh. If you beat it, then the ante goes up and all blinds become harder. Okay. Beat an eight ante to win. Now choose your path. Okay. <coughs> Alright, so like I'm... By choosing my path, I'm choosing either skip the blind and get a tag. Gives a dollar per unused discard this run. Or... That'll just give me three dollars because I've... Okay. How many dollars do I have? I have four. Or let's play the big blind. Let's let's go ahead and let's do this. 450 I have to score. Uh see you quiet. <laughs> yeah, suppy. Alright. When you get more cards. Remember, you can rearrange them. Joker's trigger to the in order from left to right. Okay. And make sure that you use your consumables. Okay. Select up to two cards. I'm gonna see if um. Just I'm gonna mess with my lighting just a little bit. Ooh. Ooh. Hmm. Looks pro. Wait. Not pro. Pro. Oh, real pro. Wait. That that looks alright. Am I a little Am I a little sick? Am I a little sick? No. I got sick of waiting to get healthy, so I decided just to stream all sick. Fuck it. Um thanks, nothing, nothing. Select up to two cards in your hand and press use on the tarot card to enhance them. All right, so, okay. Let's, which one should I enhance? My pair? My highest two cards that are a pair? Let's do that. I don't know if that's good or not, but I'm going to do that. Okay, so, it says press use on the tarot card to enhance them, but I can't get, oh, there I got to it. Oh, I see. You have to, like, okay. Seems that, um... Playing with the controller is a little bit awkward because I'm pressing up right now, but it won't let me get to the tarot card unless I scroll all the way to the right of my hand, then press up. It also goes from the three, and the other three, and the four, but not the five. All right, now I know. All right. Uh, use. All right, so, bam. So, ooh, they became special cool guards. Blech. So, let's play a hand. I have two pair. Should I do that or should I try something better? Like, let's do a discard. Let's get rid of the two. I don't see that being valuable for me. Let's get rid of the 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 two and the four. I like the on suit seven and five, so I'll keep those. Discarding. Ooh, ooh. What do I got going here? An ace high with uh, two pair. Let's play that hand. Can I just play a hand with four cards? Should I do that? Like... I did it earlier. I played a hand with five, uh, like less than five cards. Like I'd like to keep the ace. I don't think that the ace high is gonna give me enough chips to matter. I'd rather have it stick around. Does having a higher pair give you more points as well? Like I'm not trying to beat anybody else's hand, so I don't think it matters if the cards are high. What matters is that they earn you lots of chips being high. So I'm just gonna throw the ace in there. I don't think it's worth not playing. All right, there's a lot of info. I thank you guys for trying, but I'm, I'm having tr trouble keeping up. I'll just kind of figure it out as I go. If, unless I get stuck or something. 
Thanks for trying to help me, though. All right, playing that hand. I'm sure I'm not doing things completely efficiently, but that's part of learning a game. Okay, so those... Okay, okay, wait a minute. I didn't get points for having a pair. That's what that looked like. I didn't see extra points for... Is, is that because two pair is not a hand? Well, I won anyway. Let me see that run info. Uh, two pair is a hand. So I, I should have gotten points of... And then you got that multiplied by two due to the two jacks. <laughs> so two pair means you get 20 points per pair or something here. And that's your bonus, and then you get all the points for the cards themselves. Oh, I see, Lacrea. All right, I'll look on the left next time. <coughs> all right, I'm going to keep going here. I'm just going to turn off the mic again for a second here. Excuse I don't want you to hear the nasal congestion. <laughs> Excuse me. It's quite the return to streaming. I'm doing my best here. <laughs> uh, just a second here. Yeah, I've got studio light on. Hmm. Yeah, I like studio light. I could turn on portrait. Make that background blur. doesn't really seem to do a difference. Oh, look what I can do. <laughs> uh, yeah, that seemed really not that great. <clears throat> That's not even good. I've seen it actually kind of be good in the past. <laughs> I can also go like put two peace signs up. It seems to be actually having trouble separating me from the background. Because it's not blurring the background. I'm sorry guys, I'm just figuring shit out today. bring myself closer further away but um there we go now it's got the background all right now this should work better there we go yeah yeah that's how it's supposed to work <laughs> but it doesn't like it thinks that the stuff through here isn't bad it, it's like so this is not blurred it's pretty awkward <laughs> and then you can go like Yeah, special effects of budget went up. All right, all right, let's play the game. I'm fucking getting distracted. Let's play. Everybody comes here to watch games. I can view my deck. I can cash out. I'll cash out. All right. Shop. Improve my run. So let me shop. I am in the shop. All right. Uh, Uranus hat. <laughs> Auto buy. Not discovered. Level up two pair. Level one. Level up. Two pair, plus multiplier, and plus 20 chips. I have no idea what this means. What do they mean? Like, when I use it, it will do that? Convert... This, I understand. Converts up to three selected cards to hearts. Oh, that'll help me get, like, flushes and shit. But what does this mean? It makes your two pair stronger. Okay. So it's saying two pair becomes this instead of what it was. I like this one a lot. I'm gonna buy it. I have $8 left. 
I don't know about the Uranus, uh, if that's good or not, maybe it is, but I really want a booster pack. <laughs> like, I really want the booster pack. <laughs> Choose one of up to three planet cards to be used immediately, or the Arcana pack. Um, two pair gangs that, so it'll have what it is and then have that in addition. Is that good, or is that the best thing ever in the world? Should I get it? I want I wanted booster pack though. Choose one of up to five tarot cards to be used immediately, or one of up to. Th I want to see what these celestial. Two pair can be better than say a full house if you do enough of those. Oh. Mm. All right, I'll do both. I'll do that, and I'll do this celestial pack. Ooh, mm. oh, that felt good. <laughs> Open that up. Oh, yeah. <coughs> All right. Not discovered yet. Okay, that just means this is my first time encountering it. Level up pairs with plus one multiplier and 15 chips. So this probably, when uh, leveling up pair probably doesn't, um, probably doesn't affect two pair. Like they're probably kept separate, right? Like when you play, you don't you're not getting the bonus for pair and two pair if you play two pair. Levels up the straight flush to plus three multiplier and forty chips. Levels up the full house to alright, uh Let's do the full house level up. Alright. I think I'm done spending. Next round. How do you guys usually play? Do you usually like just sell out on the shop or do you like save your money sometimes? I'm gonna face a boss? Alright. Here we go. You can get it so a pair is just as good as a straight flush if you get enough. It's one of the ways you can build a deck. You probably want to go up to that Uranus and use it. <laughs> All right, um, let's use it. Yeah, you don't wanna, you, like that's for the run, so you don't want it to like sit there, right? And then, oh, I can I can right away have a straight, whoa! <laughs> the jack got multi, so it's permanently changed. Oh, look what I got, I got like jack, queen, king, should I try to make... I'm under, I'm seeing where the challenge is now. I want to keep these. I want to keep... I want to go for a... Uh, what do you call it? Let me see what it's called again. On... on it's called a... Yeah, a flush. A straight flush would be great. And... I mean, four, five, six, I'm getting close to a, a, a straight flush. If I had a nine and a, if I just had a 10, I'd be in a pretty good spot here as well. But I can only hold so many things. I just don't know what to focus on. The flush or the straight. Remember the boss ability? He's gonna make me discard two. So that'll make it, and it's random. So I'm gonna lose what I'm trying to set up here anyway, right? So, all right, let's forget about the straight. I wanna go for the flush, I think. I don't know if that's a good idea. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm gonna discard these car, oh shit. I did it without, oh my God, I did it. All right, yay. <laughs> we'll go for the, yay, a flush. There it was again, winning and not realizing it. <laughs> so I'm, I've almost won already against this boss, quote unquote. All right, what do I got? I've got like, a six, seven, eight. I like that they arrange them at least really quickly in order, so you don't have to like mess around with that. 
Six, seven, eight. I'd need a nine and a ten to get a straight. Um, otherwise, I have. Mm, I got like nothing in hand here, so I'm gonna need to discard something first. What does this do again? Converts three of the selected cards to hearts. Oh, I didn't even remember that. All right, so I'm just gonna do that then. Uh, let's see here. Is this permanent, the sun? Does that, put, for the rest of the run, make these cards, it, like, hearts? Is it, can you, like, permanently, like, change your whole deck to one suit or something? That's hilarious. Okay. All right, that's really interesting. Okay, but I have to keep in mind, if I do this, I'm, like, diluting the other suits that I'm doing this to. So, maybe I should focus on, like, I don't care about diamonds this run at all, but I really care about hearts. So, let's, like, focus on changing all my diamonds into hearts. So, I'm gonna go, like... You know, like... Select that one, and select that one, and the queen... I don't have another diamonds to do it to. No, I do. Uh, and this one. I'm gonna make all those hearts. Okay. Play that hand, you bitch. <laughs> Does anybody remember E3 2000 and I think 12 when I was sick? Sean Mail did a pretty good highlight reel of it. Oh, what am I doing? What's that shadow? Oh, it's my... I don't know what's that that's all about. Crazy. Uh... Tell him about contrast mode. Do I want that? Like, I know that it's a, like a um, accessibility setting. Oh no, I gotta pick up my daughter in 55 minutes. I can be a bit late today. All right, cashing that out. I win, I win, and everybody sucks but me. All right, I think this game's got potential to be fun. I knew they were gonna spice it up. So, you guys want me to put on high contrast mode? Uh. <coughs> I don't see it. <coughs> oh, there they are. <coughs> I'll see that how that looks. I'm glad you like the stash. I think it really suits me. Unironically, like, I'm not doing it to be like, ha ha ha, mustaches, ha ha ha. I think mustaches are genuinely good looking on the right people, and I think that they need to be made a lot less ironic. Like, you know, Movember, for all the good it does, for the, sh the, the cause that it does, I think has done some detrimental effects on mustaches. It's like, I would never wear a mustache otherwise, because they're ridiculous, but I'm raising money, I'm, so I'm putting this ridiculous thing on my face for this month. Like, no, mustaches are just fucking awesome. All right, here we go. What's a voucher for? Any... Anti-2 Voucher. Permanently get plus one discard per round. I haven't been using discards much. Is this good, guys? Oh, I don't have enough money. It doesn't matter. Standard pack. Choose one of three playing cards to add to your deck. I'm not a huge fan of adding chaff to my deck. Like, why, why would I... I don't really... Like, I guess I could stack my deck with, like, all aces or something over time if I really committed to this strategy, but... I'm never really a fan of adding to a deck. I like removing from a deck. That's what makes a deck I find in roguelikes and in real life, that's what makes things more streamlined and better, like more efficient and reliable. The more you add to a deck, the less reliable it becomes because there's too many like elements that can happen. Um, 
Yeah, and like it makes it so that you draw your best cards more often if you have less cards in the deck. Okay, uh, let's see here. Joker. Yeah, I might buy a Joker though. I have enough money for it. Each played card with a diamond suit gives you a. Oh, that goes against what I just decided was my strategy. I'm staying away from diamonds. Here's another Joker though. Plus one multiplier per consecutive hand played without a scoring face card. So if I'm if I'm deciding I'm kind of like running Yeah, if I went with this, you want to focus on flushes. And I'm kinda of liking the flushes. Okay. <laughs> Alright, next round. Let's play a ne the next one. For the right joker, it changes the suit every round. What does this guy do? He just sits there? Oh, plus four multiplier. So, okay, so how, the, how do the joker, the jokers like execute every hand or something from left to right? Like, or like it's like... Ahem. <laughs> All right. All right. So if I skip this small blind, I would upgrade four of a kind by three levels. So what is the downside to skipping? Why would I not want to skip this? Because I lose out on the reward for beating this guy, like the cash reward. So it's like whether I want the cash or I want the upgrade. How much money is the reward? It doesn't tell me. Oh, I guess that depends on what cards I play. Wait, is that how that works? All right, so I have to decide whether the upgrade is potentially worth skipping the store and the money. Um, all right, I'm not really caring about four of a kind, so let's play. <laughs> What the hell is a blue card for? The five of clubs, why are you blue? I got four of a kind here. Yellow? That's high contrast mode? Oh, okay, is that's accessibility mode. Uh, that's kind of fucking with me. I guess I understand, because it lets you separate the... It'll probably stop fucking with me. I'll just go with this. I understand why that's a good thing, because then you can really see your suits at a glance, right? Here, sort my hand by suits, please. Yes. I got four hearts. So... What else do I have? Do I have, like, a straight going here or anything? Not really. I have three of a kind. How much is that worth? I have a full house, actually. Hey, what's this? Okay, I see. Full house is pretty good hand, so maybe I should just do the full house. See, that's probably the thing that's going to give me the most anxiety, is remembering my multipliers. And there will be points in my run where a full house isn't even worth that much compared to the, the all kinds of fucky stuff that I've set up with my deck. So I'll have to remember... like whether stuff is worth going for or not anyway I'm gonna I'm just gonna like and I do have the full house upgraded yeah I guess you can just you don't have to do the math that much you just have to look at the levels maybe oh I won fuck you you bitch I'm sorry I'm all saucy I've just been talking to a baby for half a year. Now I'm talking to adults. So I get to say stuff like fucky and fuck you. And come. You can see the scoring on the run info. Alright. Cash that shit out. I can say shit and damn. Yeah. So. Uh, reserve parking? <laughs> Bylaw Joker. Alright. Each face card held in hand is a 1 in 2 chance to give you... Oh, so this is... I'm gonna focus on 
flushes and not playing my face cards. Nice! All right, next round. Choose two of up to five tarot cards to be used immediately. Nah, I'm gonna keep playing. You know, it's funny you say that, Lakria. 18 years from now, are we gonna have a videos of your child? Well, I guess she can decide to stream or not. I am debating whether to do videos with my daughter in the like, you know, future. Like maybe when she's like 11, 12, where we play games together. It's something I'll have to decide in over a decade. So it's nothing to think about now. But you know, being in Japan gives a certain. I feel like I'm very much like my biggest concern with streaming with my kid in the in the future or something like that would be. Um, people being pieces of shit uh but at least they wouldn't be dangerous pieces of shit considering we're a world completely separated from all that anyways this is another topic for another day it's just like when i was younger when youtube was first starting up i used to love this podcast where this dad and this little boy his son of like seven or eight it was just a podcast where they just talked and I fucking loved it. Like, it was genuine just, like, back and forth banter between a, a man and his son. And the son had such, like, interesting insights and stuff. Like, he was cute, but also intelligent. And it was just, like... Anyway. Uh... Good to see you, Kayla. It's the fresh, hey Emilio. All right, need to focus. It's time to play the game. It only lasted for like a, a year or a couple years, Cyrus. All right, I am playing the game. All right, so, all right. We're trying to focus on not, I want to hold face cards and I want to create flushes when possible. Uh, I mean, yeah. So, I don't really have anything close to a flush going here. My closest would be to hold the jack, who has a multiplier on him, so it's okay to play some face cards. I don't have to play none all the time. Um, let's do this. Let's discard these and see what happens. Okay. Damn, I got like a... King Queen Jack almost got uh, no nah, that's not don't don't worry about that. <laughs> um Could I end up with a clubs? Fuck it. Discard those. I want a flush. I do, you do have a straight one away? What? King Queen Jack. I don't fucking know what's going on. Well, there we go. Here we go. Now I got my flush. Is it worth playing him for the multiplayer or worth keeping him because he's a face card that will give me a random money potentially? <laughs> yeah, I mean, Cody, you're probably not going to be able to keep up with advice to me, so. Thanks for trying, but I'm not gonna... I'll be looking over seeing your advice and thinking it refers to the hand I'm playing, but it's actually uh, two hands back or something. Oh, you are old, Carno. Down to add 10 for some chips. I have no idea what's going on. I'm just gonna do this. I'm gonna play that hand. I got two monies for those guys. Multiplyings. So I have three more hands potentially. <laughs> I've been good, Bentham, Mr. Bentham. Baby CZ, J C CZ James. I'm, I, I'm gonna focus on the card, like m my type of games for now. Which is like roguelikes, card games, 
you know, the stuff Frash likes for a while. And I might start to look at other stuff eventually. But let's let's ease me into this. I might play some magic. I might like, you know. I'm facing an opponent. Are you facing I mean, no. No, I don't think you face an opponent. You're beating the blind. You might face opponents in the as the game goes on. I don't know. Let's discard those. I have two discards left this game. <coughs> Ooh. There we go. Yeah, if I can do it, I'll turn diamonds into hearts as I go on. And then I'll start on other suits once I get to a certain point. <laughs> I think that went okay. I'm sure I could have made more money somehow or whatever. <laughs> so I got $2 for each remaining hand. I didn't get any bonus for remaining... Oh my god. I didn't get any bonus for remaining discards. Because I didn't get that, that upgrade earlier. Is it? Yeah, it's just like solitaire in a way. Okay. I have $10. I could get some tarot cards. I could get some spectral cards. I could get a voucher to permanently gain discard plus one per round. I'm starting to see the value in discards now. I think I might grab that voucher. Gangs plus three multiplier when booster pack is skipped. You mean every time I go shopping and I skip a booster pack, I get multiplier? That's interesting. Every played card counts in scoring. Hmm. <clears throat> ah, I see what you mean. If I get a booster pack and choose not to... You know what? I'm just going to go for this... Mm. All right, you guys are saying Spectral's cool. I'll go with your advice. Ooh, ugh, oh. What the fuck am I doing? Why are these guys up here? Why do I have a hand for this booster pack? Destroy one random... Oh, Spectral adjusts, like, does things to your cards. I see. Thanks, Flashpoint. Thanks, buddy. Why does that have a three? A balloon with a three next to your name. What's that all about? Oh, let's celebrate their third super on a live stream. Oh, I see. I see. I got super chat, everybody. I got super chat. I'm a real streamer. You know what they should call it? They should call it Turbo. That would be a really good idea. If I was a company, I would steal that. <laughs> you get a multiplier when you open okay yeah not to okay all right let's focus guys i haven't seen you in so long i'm getting really distracted by the fucking chat all right destroy one random card in your hand well i don't want to lose hearts so i'm not going to do that and add two random enhanced aces to your hand e let's see here what add a foil a holographic or polychrome effect to your hand Plus, to, to one selected card in the hand. How about the Ace of Hearts, since I'm going for this hearts thing? Yeah, let's do that. How about these other ones? Add Polychrome to a random Joker destroys all other Jokers. Oh, I don't want to destroy my Jokers. No. Have you thought about playing Death Road to Canada? It's the Oregon. Yeah, I've always thought about playing that game. Yeah, and thank you, Cody. And Flashpoint. <coughs> <coughs> oh yeah, I get to play Hearthstone again. I'm allowed to play Hearthstone because like, you know, I fucking did my duty. I avoided that piece of shit company and now they, you know, the fucking guy at the top has got a golden parachute. He's gone and fucking Microsoft owns Blizzard now. I get to play, uh, I get to play Overwatch again too. It's coming. It'll happen, guys. <laughs> don't converts all cards 
in hand to a single rank. Wait, what's a rank? A single random rank. What the fuck's a rank? <clears throat> Numbers are letters. What? The number on a card? Huh? What number? And then I get negative one hand size from now on. So, so I would, it would like randomly choose a number and convert them all, but they would all keep their same suit. So all of these, like my ace, my king, my two aces and my king would become like a random number from, oh, it includes jack, queen, king. Okay, let's do that. Let's fucking do that. Fuck it. I want to see it. Holy shit. Cool. <laughs> uh, and then I'm, I'm gonna do this one. Lucky seven, yeah. I'm gonna do this one um, on one of my seven of hearts. Oh, I can't do another one? Why can't I do this one? It's not letting me do that one anymore. Select a card, then you do it. Oh, okay. <coughs> okay. I see. Okay, thank you. <coughs> Alright, let's play the next round. Choose your next blind. I'm going against the boss, the window. All diamond cards are debuffed. Haha, <laughs> I don't even want diamonds. Here we go. All diamond cards are debuffed. All right. Well, I will get rid of it and it and it. I'm focusing on hearts and sevens. Uh, discard. Hmm, that's too bad. I got three of a kind. Do I want to discard again? So this is going to be the difficult thing. Do you want to spend discards for like epic hands or do you just... I guess you have to balance discards with hands and how many you have left. Like eventually you have to say like this is good enough to play as a hand. It's nothing special but I'll just go ahead and... Toss it out there. Three of a kind. So I'm just gonna play this. I don't know if this is the best math wise, but I don't I wanna balance. I don't wanna run out of discards. Um yeah, playing a hand is kind of a shitty discard. Oh here we go. Here's my buffed hearts. Plus fifty chips is what I get for this. And then that will add to the multiplayer. That's huge. That's a huge buff. Um Let's try to get uh, a, a, a straight a, a flush. So I'm gonna discard everything that's not hearts here. I got a flush and a three of a kind. So can you have three of a kind and a flush? You can. Ah. Uh, so getting all those sevens didn't really matter, but it ups my ability to have three of a kind every so often and 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 full houses. So I guess that's nice too. Or like I could get five of a kind. Now, I'll play that hand. Ooh! Eh? I think I'm gonna get this. I think I'm gonna win. Uh, seven, eight, nine. Um. 10 queen no, I'm not I'm not very close to uh <coughs> this is a really bad hand I'll use my last discard
not very good either. I can't discard anymore, so I've got a, a pair. And then an ace high, queen. I guess I'll just play my, my, my face cards. And I'll keep my... Should I keep... I'm going to keep the ace of hearts. And play this piece of shit too. No reason to keep it. I'll just play those. I have two pair? What? Oh, motherfucker. Eh, whatever. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> this game should have a... Have a thing that just like tells you what you have, because this is too hard. <laughs> yeah, the two, there was being distracted by the big X. What do we got here? Improve your run. Every played card permanently gangs plus four chips when scored. Here, just a second here, guys. Oh, thanks, Cody. There's a bingle bingle, which is this but roulette. Oh, yeah? Interesting. Uh, whoops. Okay. So I have $9, which means I can buy everything here except for the voucher. The Joker gets point a half times multiplier for each card. Wait a minute. If you multiply something by 0 0.5, it reduces everything by... It reduces something. I don't think that's how this works. I think that's probably not how it works, but... <clears throat> I mean, I like... You know, I, I'm not a roulette fan, but I'm, I would be a fan of roulette with this <laughs> type of game. It goes from, yeah, so it adds, yeah. But if you had like a zero multiplier to start, is that not a thing? It's always one times? It starts at one times, okay. Uh, all right, what am I doing? All right, for each card sold. No, I don't, I don't want that. Every card, every played card permanently gangs plus four chips when scored. What? Oh, okay. So that's just like adding. And is that, is that also usable with the multiplier? That seems really good. If that can also have the multiplier applied. We also have celestial pack. I only have nine dollars. I could get that Joker plus a booster pack. Choose one of up to two spectral cards to be used immediately, or choose one of up to three planet cards. Let's do the spectral again. I like m m the modification of my deck that this allows me to do. Converts all the cards in hand to a single random suit. Boy, that would be amazing if it convert. Ah, it's not worth it. I already have four hearts in there, and I would only. Yeah, the risk isn't worth the reward. Whereas, add a purple seal to one selected card. Creates a tarot card when discarded. So, <laughs> if I want tarot cards, this king will generate tarot cards for me. Or maybe I want this five to generate tarot cards for me. I'll probably discard the fives a lot. Use it. And I'm gonna buy this guy. Let's see how he does for me. Alright. Next round. Um, <coughs> I gotta make 2800 this time. Or I can skip it and get a spectral pack. <coughs> um. I think the money I gang is better than that reward. I'm still in a magic, Warren. All right, what do we got here? Uh, let's sort by suit. We've got three hearts, two clubs. By rank, we got a jack, queen. We got two. We got two pair. Uh. How much is two pair worth? 40 times three. I think that's probably worth playing. And then I'll play my queen high, I suppose. It's 
So he's upgrading my guys as I play them. And so that's going to be cumulative over time. So he's really rewarding you for playing lots of guards. I didn't even think of it as cumulative. That's really good. That guy's amazing. If you get him early in a run, I guess. Am I early in the run? I don't even know how early, where I am in the run. I don't know how long runs last. All right, I've got hearts. Now I'm going to want to discard to get a, a, a flush. So I'm going to get rid of my pair. <laughs> All right. Bam, bam, bam. Ooh, is three of a kind better than going for the flush? If I got like, no, probably not. Like if I, nah, it's not worth do, spending a discard. I'm wondering if a full house is better than a flush though. And I'm gonna keep that jack in hand because I get money when I keep face cards in hand. Play the hand. I feel like a genius. That's what a good roguelike does. <laughs> it makes you feel like you're amazing. Until until it smacks you in the face and says, no, you're not. You've hit a wall. I can peek at my deck. That doesn't seem right. That's amazing. Tells you what the possibilities are coming up. <clears throat> Look for the Jupiter Celestial Pack to improve my flushes. All right, thanks. What do you guys think of the pixel effect I've been using today? Instead of blur. Is it neat, especially for a pixely game, or is it distracting? Got two sevens. Not a lot going on here. Maybe it would be distracting with a more action-packed game. We'll just we'll just mess around with stuff like this. Hmm. Hmm. The the censored days. All right, I gotta go quick here because I'm gonna have to get ready to go get my daughter from daycare. I gotta get I gotta go pick up my daughter from daycare. Um. <laughs> All right, guys. I don't. I don't know what I. My best thing. Like, I think I have to discard. This is a really bad hand for what I'm doing. I'm just gonna keep my. Yeah, I'm discarding everything except for that. <laughs> Here we go. Ooh, two kings, two nines. It's not ideal, but... I'm one away, I don't want to, like... I was one away from a straight. <clears throat> I'm gonna I'm not gonna play my jack. I'd rather keep the hearts in hand. I'm gonna get rid of the four. I have one more hand to play, so this actually is pretty close. I'm gonna have to use my discards to get a really epic hand to finish this off. Um, let's get a tarot card, first of all. I'm gonna use one of my discards here. Get rid of everything that's not a heart. Discard. So what's my ta tarot card? Enhances one selected card into a stone card. Mm. 
I don't know, Cody. Uh, yeah, it's gonna. I, I want to stream a bit more consistently. Like um, the fact that I have a window during the day to stream, obviously, because Echo goes to daycare. So. Um, I'd like to stream more consistently, and that also means lengthwise. Like, I find I have a tendency to burn myself out because I start streaming and I get excited about it, and then I do like four or five hour streams, and then the next day I don't feel like streaming because I like talked too much in one go. I wouldn't mind trying to be more consistent uh, and keeping the stream short and just, you know, um, like within the two hour range. So maybe tomorrow, but you know. Also, it also depends how much my, uh, you know, how well I sleep, mostly because of how Echo sleeps. Like, because Becky has to go to a proper job, so I um, try to pull up the weight at night to stay up with Echo if she's having trouble sleeping. So, we'll see what happens. Um, I am daddy of a baby, so I'll stream when I can. One more discard? I think it's worth it. I need a final epic hand. Oh, I didn't read my tarot. Enhances one selected card into a stone card. What does that even mean? Plus 50 chips. No rank or suit. All right, I'll decide what to do after I discard. Okay, thank God I ended up with a, a, a straight, or I mean a flush. I'm going to upgrade my Joker. My jack, I mean. Use. <coughs> oh, uh, well, if I'm, what the fuck? Oh, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Oh, I didn't read the card right. I just destroyed one of my hearts. Burns the suit. Yeah, that's pretty much what I did. <laughs> and now I don't think I can win. Oh no. <laughs> Did I just completely fuck myself? I have a pair. Maybe I can still get enough. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't read that card. I blame Cody. He asked me about Kit Kats. It's okay. I think I'm fucked though. Let's just see what happens. Well, I got 50 plus multipliers. Let's see what happens. Maybe it'll work out. It's not gonna work out. I might, I might. Oh, just barely. Anyways, uh, it, my favorite Kit Kat flavor was matcha. Until I really started to go hardcore anti Nestle. So fuck Nestle, I hate Nestle so much. They're just so evil. They're just so freaking evil. Not There's not many companies in the world that seem to like wear it like a badge of honor. Like, Nestle doesn't care how bad they are. You can Google around to see why. Cashew. It's too bad, because I like Kit Kats, but... Alright. Let's see how much more I can get done here before I, I need to go. Wait, I, I have time for one more round, guys. Um... You guys distracted me a lot today, so I didn't get a lot done in the game. I've been like, it's been so long since I've talked to people that weren't a baby. <clears throat> Thanks, Warren. <laughs> it's good to be back. A negative joker? Well, I don't have any money, so I can just skip to the next round right away here. That's easy. Uh, I got a big blind to go up against. Choose two up to... Uh, do I want Mega? Nah. <laughs> Alright, there's my stone card, which completely goes against my game strategy. My deck strategy of playing hearts. God damn it. You know, I haven't even really, really built that strategy out that much. Maybe I just should, like, say fuck it to that strategy and try to do something else here. Like, I only converted, like, a few cards into... It's not like I had converted my whole deck into hearts. What do I got? What's the best thing I have here? One, two, three, five, four. Let's try to go for a straight. So I guess this card doesn't count in straights at all, eh? So stone cards probably don't, like, fucking help you at all. 
<laughs> Trying for a straight. I got a pair. Ace, queen. I need a king. Yeah, let's go for a straight. I don't know what I'm doing. I shouldn't have gotten rid of my foil. Fuck me. Alright, I got two pair. This is bad. I think I'm kind of like just imploding the, the, the run anyway because I do have to go get, get Echo. The closer it gets to Echo time, the more anxious and excited I get because I can't wait to see Echo. That baby makes me very happy. She's the cutest freaking thing. Here we go. That was easy. I am a little bit half-assing it now. Alright. Hmm. My best chance is maybe getting club flush, three of a kind, four of a kind. Oh, that's nice. That's a pretty good hand. And I get to keep two on suit cards. Maybe I shouldn't have played that nine. I should have just played the four of a kind and kept the nine because it was on suit. I'm learning, I'm learning. Uh, I got a flush. Maybe I'll be able to do this. Oh, that was my last hand. No, I won't. Or do I get one more after this? Ah, that's... You know what? I probably wasn't going to win anyway. That was a, a big... That was a big blind beat, and <clears throat> even in the best case scenario, I don't think I had quite synergized my deck enough at this point to even go much further. This is fun, though. I'm definitely going to want to give this another another shot on another stream. Now that I've learned it, we'll do a round two at the very least, just to see how it goes. Fun! So... Blue deck unlock. Discover at least 20 items for your collection. Plus one hand every... Okay. Yeah, refreshing. Fun new, um... Fun game. You're welcome for the stream, guys. It was fun hanging out. Uh... <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, I had to stream, um, sick. Uh, you know, yeah, so this setup's good for, like, casual streaming, and I'm a lot more comfortable, and, uh, it's so nice playing with headphones. You get to really, like, this game doesn't really, it's just music the whole time, but, like, you know, when I get to play games with spatial audio, it's gonna be a lot more fun to play with proper headphones. All right, guys. Oh, I look rough. <laughs> oh my god. All right. This this was my first dad fresh game stream. More to come. The office chair is better than the couch. Yes, it's a it's a um. I slouch on a couch, and that's not good for your back or neck. Whereas this is a uh, Herman Miller proper ass desk chair that keeps my posture kind of good. All right, guys. See y'all later. Thanks for watching. Until next time. How do I get out of here? Bye-bye.